So, you're looking to move to Fairhope and the Rock Creek neighborhood has got your attention. Trust me, we get it. It's a golf course community, beautiful mature trees, golf carts on every corner, custom homes. What's not to love? That's right. Rock Creek might look like your dream neighborhood on paper, but we're here to give you the real scoop. The good, the bad, and everything in between. I'm Jess, and this is my husband, Tony. We're the number one relocation team in Baldwin County. After you watch this video, make sure to give us a call so we can help you with your move to Lower Alabama. Now let's get started. We're not just talking pretty houses and manicured lawns. We're digging into what it's really like to live in Rock Creek. The stuff nobody tells you about. If you're ready for some honest, no fluff insights, you've come to the right place. Let's dive into the real Rock Creek. Rock Creek isn't just any neighborhood. It's a whole experience. Picture this, sprawling golf courses, lush greenery, and stunning views. It's like living in a postcard. But you know, there's a flip side to that. Along with this beauty, Rock Creek is going through some really big changes and one major change is the cost of living. Yeah, and it's drawing in a whole new crowd. We've got a lot of newcomers that are looking for that upskill lifestyle, but for the folks who've been here for a while, it's a mixed bag of feelings. Obviously, Rock Creek is evolving, and with that comes a new chapter. It's an exciting time to be here, but it's also a time of adjustment for everyone. So diving into the real estate scene in Rock Creek, we're looking at a pretty diverse range. You've got these charming single family homes that are pretty for, let's say, a young couple or retirees looking to downsize. And then on the other end of the spectrum, we've got these custom built luxurious estates for the CEOs and attorneys and doctors and even professional sport athletes. Just don't ask who because that's classified information. Oh my gosh, some of the homes here are like something out of a magazine. Augusta Court is a known street in Rock Creek because of their breathtaking homes. And the variety of Rock Creek as a whole doesn't disappoint. You've got homes with sleek, modern looks, but then just down the road, there's classic Southern beauty with porches just banging for those rocking chairs. Exactly. And the thing is, each of these homes has its own personality. One thing you need to know is it has a very low turnover. Homes for sale here can be far and few. And those turnkey, appropriately priced homes will fly off the market in 24 hours. And there's gonna be homes that aren't turnkey that will still fly off the market. Do you remember that one client we had? Um, he wanted to lowball a house in Rock Creek, even though we told him don't do it, it's not a good idea. And that one was on Augusta Court and it was priced under a million. Yeah, I do. And lo and behold, it sold for over asking, even with the amount of work that needed to be done there. But there's also the phases in Rock Creek that offer some more modestly sized homes that don't necessarily fly off the market, but don't wait too long because they do sell. Yeah, and there are homes modest in size, but still have that custom built like wow factor, yeah? And these are perfect for retirees or adults with no children, um, looking for the golf course lifestyle. And that's exactly who those particular homes cater to. And they don't go for sale very often. So what we're trying to say is you'll need to be aggressive when looking for a home in Rock Creek because it's a very desirable community. For some, that pressure to find a house is a deterrent and they'd rather go a different route. And we get it. Who wants to make a hasty decision on one of the largest purchases of your life? <laughs> well, that's where we come in as your realtors to help you navigate through that because the process is crazy and the market here is something that you may not have seen before. Buyer competition is not what it used to be. Rock Creek has a variety of homes and it comes with a range of price points, but it's not just about falling in love with a house. You've got to think about the whole package, um, the taxes, the HOA, the upkeep. Um, let's be real, some of those estates, they're not exactly low maintenance, are they? No, just hit the nail on the head. It's about finding that balance. You might fall head over heels for a property, but if it's gonna stretch your budget too thin, is it really worth it? Property taxes in Rock Creek are known to be a little higher because of its proximity to Mobile Bay and its larger square footage and the lots that they sit on. And then you've got an HOA, which isn't that expensive, around $600 a year, but it's still something. Plus, if you want to enjoy that golf course, it's not included. So that's another added expense. And speaking of golf course, get ready to see a lot of golf carts and yield for them, um, whether they're crossing the road to get to their next hole 
or it's just neighbors or even teenagers going for a joyride to take in the beautiful community, you're gonna encounter them daily. We know not everyone likes golf carts and we know this because we've had people comment on how annoying they can be. I personally love them and I have one of my own, but understand you will see them everywhere in lower Alabama, not just Rat Creek. Yeah, that's right. Almost every community has them. But Rat Creek being a golf course neighborhood, expect to see them all the time. And let's not overlook the lifestyle Rock Creek offers. Along with the golf course, you have the clubhouse, brunches, lunches, and dinners, all the Rock Creek community events. They're amazing perks, but remember, they will all cost you. And it's not cheap to enjoy those finer things in life. So it's essential to think about how these align with your lifestyle and what you want. Are those extra perks really worth the cost to you? That's the million dollar question, Jess. Rock <laughs> Creek offers a dreamy lifestyle, but it's crucial to keep one foot grounded in reality when it comes to your budget and what you're really looking for in a home. And I guess a community with, within all of that. That golf membership is a hefty expense. And even without the membership, just to play the course isn't cheap. They actually increased their price this year because they just had their greens redone. I don't know. I think it's expensive. Yeah. And if you watch any of our other videos, you know Fairwell Pass exploded in population. With all this growth, we're also seeing cost increases, but also improvements like the infrastructure. We're talking better roads, upgraded public services, and the schools. It's not just about growing bigger. It's about growing better. But you know, for folks who've been around Fairhill for a while, this rapid development can be a bit overwhelming. Remember how it used to be? Yeah, quiet streets, less traffic. It was a different vibe back then. No kidding. It's like when your favorite quiet spot becomes the new like it place. But it's not just about the buildings and the roads changing. The people are too. We've got this whole new demographic coming in. Each person is bringing a little piece of their world to our community. And that's a big change for the people that have been living here for a very long time. Um, we're seeing a lot of new faces and ideas that are getting mixed into the community. It's an exciting time, but it's also a culture shock for some. Yeah, it's evolving. But let's look at the bright side. This growth is about progress and stepping into a, a new chapter, if you will. <laughs> that's right. Okay, but back to Rock Creek, people. Picture these beautiful houses and the golf course. But there's this whole other side to it that's just as enchanting. Homeowners take so much pride in their homes here. You won't find anything run down or neglected. And the HOA is on top of it, um, but not in like an overstepping kind of way. They are pretty reasonable and have realistic expectations that mostly everyone appreciates and follows. And I'm glad you mentioned that. If you're someone who isn't a fan of keeping up uh, yard appearances and just maintaining your property, this might not be in the community for you. Or you'll have to factor in the expense for lawn care services. Rock Creek has a lot of mature trees that require added maintenance like trimming and uh, a lot of leaf removal a lot, a several lot. times a year. Much of Rock Creek might seem higher maintenance when it comes to landscaping, but that's the price you pay to live in a neighborhood known for its lush greenery, and landscape. It's year-round work, and if you're not a garden or lawn enthusiast, you might actually hate it. I also have to mention a lot of people think Rat Creek is away from everything, but in reality, it's surprisingly close to all the action like downtown Fairhope or downtown Old Town Daphne. Yeah, that's so true. Downtown is just a short drive away, so you have boutique stores and restaurants close by. Yeah, and Rat Creek is also on the northern end of Fairhope, bordering Montrose and, and Daphne, like I just mentioned, giving its residents easy access to get to those downtown areas and all the shopping in the heart of Daphne and Fairhope. You've got it all within reach, right at your fingertips. Rock Creek is changing, and while change can be good, it's not without its challenges. The small town charm that many of us fell in love with is evolving. The cost of living in Rock Creek is climbing, and it's making it a little more exclusive with its picturesque setting and upscale amenities. It seems like a perfect place to live, but as we've discussed, it's not without its complexities. Absolutely. Rock Creek might have the curve appeal, but it's important to think about the lifestyle and the added expenses and tasks associated with living there. That's right. Rock Creek has a lot to offer, and it's important to make sure it aligns with your vision of a home. Now, if you love being involved in community events and being a member of a golf course, 
Rock Creek could be your dream home. We hope this video helped. And to find out any more information about Rock Creek or Baldwin County in general, make sure you call us the number one relocation team. Now watch this video to learn more.